Dude, get lost. Hello everyone, I'm Arthur. Welcome back to Subnautica. Um, right, this is my third time of trying to record this one episode. Um, I'm not sure what's going on with my recording software at the minute. Um, it seems to be causing right sorts of issues. So, I now know where that last seed is that we need <coughs> to make... <coughs> to make the enzymes. Um, so I'm going to go get that now. Um, I did try and rescue the Cyclops in one of the failed recordings. It didn't work. Uh, so uh, it's still over there under a big rock. Well, it's not a big rock. It's the uh, warp gate for where we need to go, basically. Um, where's Chuckles? Oh, he's probably that over there. So um, let's jump in here. Well, before we do it, actually, uh, let's make sure I've got the right bits of kit that I need. Um, that'll do me. Sweet. So let's go and get that uh, last... Well, before I do that, let's repair this thing because he might take a chunk out of me before I go. Um, yeah, so we need to... Let's go and get the uh, last seed. I'll show you guys where it is and what it looks like. Bye, mate. See you later. You can find it easily um, near Life Pod 12. Now, with everything loading in like it is, I'm going to shove up to the uh, surface. And I'll see you at the location, guys, and then we'll dive down. Because I don't fancy getting stuck in things anymore. I've had enough of that with my Cyclops. So, we'll just keep it up here. Okay, guys, we're going down. Um, oh, God. Now, the other reason why I've managed to do this three times already um, is because the save load function on the hardcore mode that we're, we're doing, um, for some reason, doesn't seem to want to save it anymore. Uh, I don't know. I've tried to save it twice now, and it, every time we've come back here. Um, so I'm not entirely sure what's going to happen. Um, so basically what I'm going to do, guys, and I'm going to tell you this now, um, if this doesn't save, obviously I'm doing this again so you guys can see um, what happens when we get the enzymes to the Sea Emperor. Um, and there you are. There's, there's, there's it. It's been there every time, so I'm assuming it's probably going to be there every other time as well. This is the Sea Crown. Um, yeah, so what I'm going to do is, if this doesn't save on this again... Um, because I'm in roughly the same place on my um, survival game. I'm going to head over to, onto that. And, ooh, lithium. No, I don't need that. Go away. Um, yeah, I'm going to head onto my survival um, mode game. And just finish it off from there. Um, because I can't keep doing this every time. This, I did this in one episode when I tried to film it after the first one failed. Um, so I did this one, and then I did the next episode directly after it. Um, so that was like four hours of playing Subnautica. Um, and not one of it saved. So you can imagine my stress and annoyance doing all of that and um, not having anything to show for it, to be perfectly honest, because once I loaded it up again, um, it was right back here. And it's been a bit of a dick with the save load function, because um, when it doesn't save... Well, it doesn't seem to want to load up after I've quit out and come back in again either. Um, so I've literally reinstalled the game once as well, just to see if that would actually make any difference. Um, but sadly it didn't. Uh, I don't know if this is because it's, it's an old save from the previous version, because obviously, bear in mind, halfway through this um, hardcore playthrough, it's uh, updated again to the newest one. And, so, and sometimes that can cause issues, I don't know. I don't know, guys, but, you know, that's just the way it's been. That's what I've been doing. Um, and hopefully, we'll get the recording of this one now. You will see what happens. Uh, hold on a minute. What's that up there? What am I about to load into? And I don't know it's there. Let's go this way a moment. <coughs> just so I don't load into a, a cavern or something. Um, yeah. What was I saying? Can't remember. 
Anyway, the gist of it, guys, is is if if it doesn't if it doesn't save, I'll go into my survival game because that seems to be okay and working fine. And we'll carry on because I am literally at the same place that we will be very shortly once I've given the enzymes. So yeah, here we go. Oi, oi, legs. Here, Zapier. Ah, oh, you missed me, mate. Get out of here, douchebag. Sweet. Hopefully, mate, you will bugger off now. Leave me alone. Welcome aboard, Captain. Now, as though this game's been quite buggy, guys, I do love it, and I think it's an absolutely awesome game. Um, and we are coming to the end, I believe. Um, though I don't know. Um, so, if you fancy it, please do get it on your console, your computer, or whatever. I don't think you'd be disappointed, I mean, especially if you're not on, on the PC, because that's already in... Um, a production mode, well, as they say. So it's basically finished on the PC, um, and they'll uh, you release uh, incremental updates, I'm sure, throughout the game as they go on and bugs are found. Um, Xbox is yet to be released as a full proper release. I don't know if it's on the PS4. Um, maybe it will be, I don't know. We shall see. There's the enzyme 42, guys. Right, so. Um, any batteries I need to charge in here? E nope, nope, nope. Batteries are all good. That's fine then. Um, so let's go to Lady Pants and uh, give her these hatching ends on. All systems online. Go on up. Okay guys, over here, there's Big Mama. Let's go and put some hatching enzymes in. Oh. Yeah, the babies. Hello babies. Let me scan you. Gonna sit on here so we can get all the oxygen, and we don't drown in the process. They're gonna go and see their mama. sees the gaps between the grains of sand. Farewell, friend. She has been waiting all of these hundreds of years. Maybe thousands, I don't know how long they've been gone for. For that to happen. That is a long existence. Of waiting for your children to hatch and and be well happy. Right guys, there we go. <clears throat> mm. 
And just like that, it's cured. <clears throat> I am no longer infected. And just to show you. Self scan complete. Perfect. Vital signs normal. No remaining sign of bacterial infection. Goodbye, big lady. Thank you very much. It was appreciated. Your sacrifice will not be in vain. Well, it's the game, so you probably will be. Anyway, back to the sea mooth. Because we have to shut down the enforcement platform now. Ah, shoom. Well, well. Now, guys, stay together. There's five of you, uh, and you're still small. Um, so keep together. Watch out for the bigger leviathans, because they're bigger than you at the minute. And uh, just generally survive and be cool, and uh, rid this world of the horrible coronavirus. Okay, okay. See you guys there. Bye. Right. Mm -hmm. Um. Um. Nope, we'll leave that for now. Welcome aboard, Captain. I was gonna go rescue some iron crystals, but oh, <clears throat> stuff anyway. Load in, you beastie. Any time now. Thanks. Okay, another bug, we're swimming in the air. Swimming in the air. Are we gonna load in? So we're not actually underwater. Anytime soon. Here we go. <laughs> Bugs galore, guys. But, it's playable. Yeah. Oh, I went to the side for some strange and amazing reason. Oh. Oh. Ow. Punch it. Oh. Lights off. be interesting to know that if I've turned it off and obviously we heard the uh, the big horn noise um, the, if there is a sequential game after Subnautica this one made by the same people and they still follow on the story of the Aurora survivor survivor me this dude who we have no name um, if that is actually sending out um, a message to the precursors to the to the aliens before <clears throat> that the Karar is actually um, been been di been diagnosed, been sorted out, been got rid of, basically. Right. Um, there's just one other thing I need to do, other than not get trapped um, in this bloody great thing. Look, the gun's dead. It's down. Let's hit the deck, baby. Is I need to go to the Aurora. Um, because I haven't got the escape craft. Um, so we're going to go and get that. And then start building that. Bear in mind, we've got some friendly reapers around here somewhere. Okay. Just on me freeze gun and sort the little shits like that jumping our bones right I'm gonna go to the captain's quarters guys I'll meet you there okay here we are <coughs> now, for some reason I didn't get this I don't know why in 
integrating new PDA data. Average long range transmission delay, 8 hours. Opening last recorded transmission. I don't know why I didn't get this. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet 4546B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond with rescue solution. Out That's my captain. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that we calculate will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find and sit you, but it's going to need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure to... Aurora Long Range Communications Relay. Offline. Hmm. Seek fluid intake. So, yeah. So, we need to build a rocket, guys. I'm all for that. I'm all for building rockets. Whee! Oh, much. Right, guys, let's get back to the base. We've got our plans. And we just need to start building stuff now. And of course, the whole idea of powering down the enforcement platform is so we can actually blast off this rock. Because with that powered up, if we blast it off, it'd shoot us right back down again. And I've been lucky enough to survive this crash landing. I doubt I'll survive the next one. <laughs> Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you very much. Right. <clears throat> Let's go down here. Because I need this out of here. All right, so to build the rocket platform, what do we need, guys? What do we need? Right, so the Neptune launch platform, we need titanium ingot, computer chip, and lead. I think there's a computer chip down in the base with the prawn suit. I believe I've got plenty of lead in here. I do. So what did we need again? Four lead, computer chip, titanium ingot. One, two, three, four. Um, oh, I'm going to go down to the other base, guys, um, so we can go and get some stuff. Because I know we've got some stuff down there. So I'll meet you there. Whee! All systems online. Welcome aboard, Captain. Right, we're here, guys. I have no titanium in that storage whatsoever. Great. But I do believe... Yeah, there we go. Rear chip. Oh, we're on the back of old Prawny. Nothing. Welcome aboard, Captain. Alright, well, mate. Uh, I need some titanium. Oop. That might be some there. Yeah. Let's go and make a titanium ingot and get some food. Right, with that, we should now have enough to make the Neptune launch platform. So let's go and do that. Ooh, I might nick this while I'm here.
Kill beans. Cut blues. Sure, that was uh, quite epic. If you could actually see it. <laughs> right, so mobile vehicle bay. Out you go, sir. Mm, climb. Yes, please. Right, here we go. Neptune launch platform. Get ready, boys. Here we are. And there it is, guys. That is the Neptune launch platform. Let's go and have a look. Have a look around. It's Gigantormus. Now, I suppose it has to be because you've got. Oh, hello. You've got to uh, launch a bloody great rocket off of here, haven't you? Right, okay. So we need to make the gantry next. So we need. Uh, some more stuff, copper wire and lubricant. But I'm going to leave this one here, guys. Um, like I said before, I've tried to record this three times previously. I'm to a certain degree glad um, that it didn't save. Uh, reason being, of course, that you guys got to see this, uh, which is good news. And we got to see um, the babies hatching from their eggs and me being cured of the cryovirus, which was great. Um, so now we've got to build the gantry, build the rocket, and get the fudge out of here. So, yeah, that's the next one. Um, so what I'm going to do from here now, guys, obviously I'm going to now um, quit out. There we go, saving quick, because that's all the option you, you have when you're in uh, hardcore mode. <coughs> and then I am going to see if it saves. If it does not, uh, obviously the next time you'll see the Subnautica, it will be on my survival playthrough where I am, I believe I'm at this point, I might not even have this bit, I don't know um, but I'm pretty pretty damn close anyway as the sun now sets on this episode of Subnautica pretty pretty good um, so anyway guys, yeah, so look for that one coming up next, um, I think you'll enjoy it um, so anyway, uh, once again, thanks for watching and coming to watch my videos guys uh, always very much appreciated uh, of course, if you did like the video, leave a thumbs up and let me know. Um, and leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know how I'm getting on. And if you have any games you'd like to see played on the channel, please leave them there as well. And then I'll try and do as my best to get them on the channel for you and uh, and play them. Um, so with that, guys. Um, oh, yeah. And another thing. And I hate having to rattle on about this. But if you've found my playthrough, you enjoyed my Subnautica video and you want to see more, Please hit the subscribe button um, to be notified when my new content goes up. Um, at the minute I'm doing two videos a week. Um, it may increase, it may not, we shall see. Uh, but at the minute the subscriber count is pretty low. Um, and the guys that do subscribe so far seem to be enjoying my content. So hopefully uh, we'll grow and get a bit bigger. So that will be good news. Um, yeah, so anyway guys, thanks for watching again. And I will see you next time in Subnautica where we build the rocket. Thank you. Goodbye.